I've had the iPhone XR now for a week with a SIM card in it. Let's talk about it. Hey, Zach Pack, welcome back to Zach Talks Tech, where it's about the community, engagement, and conversation we're having here about the tech that you love. So I've had the iPhone XR now for about a week. I have a SIM card in there. I've got a number coming here. I'm using all the features. I'm using FaceTime. I'm using uh, the iMessage. I'm using Twitter. I've got emails coming here. I've got Facebook. I've got Instagram. All sorts of great stuff on here. Really am enjoying my time. So what are my impressions and my concessions so far? Number one, camera. Like I said before, it's a killer camera. Yes, it's not the dual uh, camera that you get on the XS or the XS Max, but for what it packs in here, it is still taking really great photos. I'm really enjoying the way the photos come out, the uh, bokeh effects, the sharpness of photos, the way the color is coming through. Overall, great camera. I've even used some of the 4K features on here, using it for some of my B-roll for my other videos as well, coming out really, really well. In addition, Face ID has really surprised me. In the past, I've had issues with this, uh, not being able to read my face quick enough, not waking up fast enough, but I've used it with and without my glasses on. It's, uh, it's lighting up, it's reading from an angle, from all different angles. I'm, I'm impressed, I take it back. Face ID is working really, really well on here. The build quality has been phenomenal. Uh, you know, I'm not too crazy about the glass back here, so I have been using a case. Right now I'm using this blue element case here. You guys saw that in a separate video. I'll leave a link for that up here and also down inside the description. This is a good case right here. It doesn't cost an arm and a leg. You guys would like it a lot. Let's talk about some of the things I don't like so far. Uh, the lack of a back button is really throwing me off and I think that just comes from coming from uh, having an Android and using an Android for so long. Not having a back button is sometimes frustrating. I have to kind of reach up to the corner there to go back, but it's kind of a minor thing. Again, I am getting kind of used to that. I've talked about this before as well. Notifications. Uh, I've gotten into the habit now of checking for notifications, but I don't feel as a user you should have to do that. I should be able to look at the phone, basically wake it up and say, oh, I have notifications. I shouldn't have to swipe down and look for something like that. Imagine if I didn't know how, or if it just slipped my mind or something like that. Uh, I might miss you know, something that, that's important. Luckily, right on the icons, as you guys can see there, there's little ones, twos, numbers basically to indicate messages and things like that I've missed. So that does help as well. But again, I'd like to see Apple implement something in the corners, blinking light, something for notifications. I would just, I would love to see that come to a future iOS build. The battery's been a little bit hit and miss. Sometimes I'm getting a day and a half, sometimes I'm getting three quarters of a day. And what I mean is by like five o'clock, six o'clock at night, I'm at 20, 25%, uh, whereas other days I might be at 50%. I think it all comes down to how much camera I'm using, things like that. Um, again, I will test this a little bit further, but overall, I would say I'm happy with the battery. I'm just not completely sold on it yet. Anyway guys, that'll do it for my first week here with the iPhone XR. You guys are gonna get 51 more weeks of this every Sunday. Expect an update for me in the evening about the previous week's time with the iPhone XR. Again, make sure you guys are checking out my Instagram and my Twitter and my Facebook for images and videos. I'm always posting stuff there. Make sure you guys are following me there on social media. And again, interact and, and ask me questions on uh, on those platforms as well, especially Twitter, uh, about things I should be checking out with the iPhone XR, and I'll get right into it. Like I said to you guys before, I have this in my left pocket, and I'm gonna have the Android, <laughs> whatever the Android flavor of the week or the month is, in this pocket. Anyway guys, I hope you guys found this helpful here. I'll see you guys next week. If you guys have an idea of what I should call this series, let me know down in the comment section. There's your question of the day. What should I call this series? I'll kind of go through them and we'll, we'll, I'll pick the best one, the one that I, I feel fits the best. Anyway guys, if you guys like the content here, please leave a thumbs up. Think about hitting that subscribe button as well. Leave me a hashtag, Zach Pack, down in the comment section there. You guys are part of my Zach Pack and I'm glad you're here. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Take care. Cheers.